Hi, nice to meet you. Uh, I'd like to ask you uh, who you are and where you come from. I'm Anthony Soroka. Um, I'm, I was born in Washington State, but I went to high school in Japan, and I studied at Princeton in the United States, studied and studied abroad in the UK, and now I'm working in, in Singapore. So I kind of have an international background. Uh, how, did, how did you feel uh, during today's, uh, today's talks? Did you feel they were very interesting? D did you relate to them? Yeah, I really enjoyed today's talks. I thought they were really insightful and they covered a lot of topics. For example, Dr. Overholt's uh, talk gave me a good insight into the political scene in Asia and the uh, macroeconomic perspective of, um, of Asia and the world in general. And also from, um, from Dr. Fung and from Dr. Lee, we had a good perspective on kind of a, a micro's perspective on how, how we can contribute to a, a business and how we can be most successful in our careers. Definitely. Um, also, what do you think about the next generation, Generation Z? Do you agree with the comments that were meant, made today? And can you tell us a story about that? Personally, I think Generation Z isn't way too different from us. I, I, do, I do agree they probably have a little bit more entrepreneurial spirit in them in the sense that they've grown up with this technology boom. So they, they've seen, they, they look at guys like um, Mark Zuckerberg or Jeff Bezos. They see these guys and these are the guys they really look up to. So I, I could see how they have a little bit more um, innovation in their blood. But then again, I think when it comes down to it, they're similar to what I was when I was when I was 15. I was, you know, we're curious, we're kind of rebellious, and um, kind of uncertain about what the future holds, but very confident that they can they can uh, have an impact on the world. So I don't think they're way too different to to, to Generation X or Generation uh, Y. That's very true. Um, can you tell us three words that would describe your future, and why would you use these three words? The first word would be impactful, because I think. In the end, just like what we talked about, these millennials, we want to have an impact on the world, a positive impact on the world. Um, the second word I would say is leadership. So I want to be a leader. I want to help other people become leaders. I want to um, enable people to find their passions and find their, their contribution to the world. And the last word hopefully would be um, it'd, be, it'd be simplistic, but enjoyable. I think life is short, so you should enjoy your life. So hopefully my future will be interesting and fun. Thank you very much. Yeah, thank you.